Chongqing is a densely built mountainous city with winding roads. The complex topography and basin landform make this city susceptible to water logging and construction of power grids difficult. When there is a problem with the underground pipeline, people can only repair it by excavating the ground, which causes great inconvenience to people's everyday lives. So this tunnel is around 3.2 meters high and 2.2 meters wide. And yesterday, due to the drizzle out there, you can see the rainwater is flowing here, but it cannot cover my foot. And according to local workers, the highest level of the rainwater is around here, which is around one meter high. So this tunnel is pretty enough to deal with all the rains around here. I mean, if you ask my feeling, the environment is okay, but I think it, it is still tough for people, for human beings to get in. But I just stayed there for like 20 minutes and I took some clips and you see the sweat on, on my face and you see the dirt on my body. I mean, this is the winter season, but it's pretty hot down inside. Now, we can solve this problem with advanced technology. The Housing and Urban Construction Committee of Yusong District in Chongqing Municipality uses micro-robots to probe inside pipes without human labor. Micro-robots go down underground pipes and use sensors, cameras and other devices to transmit images of damaged parts or obstacles to human operators. It can explore the real underground pipe network autonomously. Hence, the development of technology can make the maintenance of underground pipelines more efficient and convenient.